That's not the start that he was playing. Not in this case. Now, meanwhile, here's his second able to knock that one away. And he will go down. Now on is the punter long here as he sends this one away. On the return is Lamb. Come on again. 46 and 10 at their 35-yard line. And he's going to be brought down. Can't wait to see what their second down call is going to look like now. And the pressure gets to him again. But after the sack, it's third and long. Under pressure, and they got to him again. His first punt comes from deep in his own end zone. So a short drop, but he's able to get it out, and this is a good kick. Here now Roberts. And he's out of bounds just before the over. On first and ten, Herbert. Flushed out right. Cook with a first down and much more. And down to the 27-yard line. Herbert will give this one to Eckler. A nice display of power. Justin Herbert looking to pass. Quick hitter here, it's complete. And the charge. Trying to punch it in with Eckler. And he'll go backwards. Seeing the multiple tight end look that came out for the offense. I thought they were going to switch out of it. I didn't know if they felt they didn't have time or what the case was. Well, in any event, the extra speed. A lot. They hand off to their big tight end. And he will get in across the chalk for a Chargers touchdown. Steven Anderson. Fine work there on the touchdown run. And the Chargers have taken a first quarter lead. Extra point good by Hopkins. And that makes the score 7-0. Following the touchdown, Dustin Hopkins will kick it away. They couldn't get anything going. They had to punt from deep inside their own territory, which means you're going to lose the field position battle as a general rule. And he'll be forced out of bounds. Shy. Looking to throw. Prescott. And there is Amari Cooper, his first catch. Breaks it off, usually after about three to four steps, and cuts towards the middle of the field. And now what he's trying to do is use his body to keep the defense. To throw is Prescott. Eluding the pressure right. And he'll just get rid of it. Well, too. And again, it's Prescott. And this throw incomplete. Playing on the road, you absolutely have to get takeaways. You've got to get the ball from them. Yeah, win that turnover battle going to be key. They didn't get one there, but you get the... Now Prescott. Throw left side complete. That's Schultz. Defense stands tall, and they get the football back. Off the play fake to Eckler. It's Herbert. And this is caught. First catch for Keenan Allen. Defenders going in the wrong direction. It is awfully hard for them to pivot back, and you end up getting the first down. And down to the 44. Five. Second and five. A give, Eckler running to the right. And he takes it down to the 40 with a pick and friend, Jonathan Coachman. Coach will run through some of the numbers and the next-gen stat. Trying to force it to Allen, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Jordan Lewis. There he goes, right side. The 20. And he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Cowboy defense has a touchdown. Zerline connects on the extra point, and we are tied here in the second quarter. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. Position through the pick six, obviously costly. But they can't afford to just bunker in now. All right, they, good field position means... That didn't bother you too much last time. No, because it's, it's exactly what you're supposed to do. You can't have good field position not try to take advantage. To throw again on second down. Herbert over the middle. It's Jared Cook. And he's going to have another... Herbert back to the air. 
He's got the first down here inside the 30. And then he forced the ball into coverage through the pick. He learned better there. Yeah, similar to a golfer that's confronted with a shot that you just can't make. Sometimes you have to take your medicine race. Quarterbacks utilize that as well. A much more confident throw right there. Meanwhile, Herbert's throw going into the hands of Williams. Second and two. Out of the gun, Herbert. Escaping the pressure right. And he will not throw it away. He goes out of bounds, well shy of the line of scrimmage, so that's a sack. So three seconds here remain in the half. On is the field goal unit to see about getting three points. And Hopkins' kick is good. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. Both teams making their final preparations for the second half of action. So with that, let's get you back out to Arlington, where we rejoin Brandon and Charles. Welcome back. Charles and I settled into the booth, ready for quarter number three. It's the Cowboys who get the football first, and they trail here as well as we resume action in the third quarter. This is Tony Pollard. Oh, a good-looking return set up here. The 40, Tony Pollard. He will score. Touchdown, Cowboys. We've sat in a lot of meetings, and they always talk about the offense taking advantage of beginning a half. So special teams coaches don't listen to that. They want to take advantage with their own unit, and they just did. Yeah, they trailed in the locker rooms, and they changed that immediately. I think they drew that one up special. That felt like something he pulled out of his pocket that he'd been holding for a while. And they were, able to... they were forced to take the short field goal. And the key phrase, you nailed it. Forced to, because fighting through, and he's got space. And he's able to get this to the 40 and 10. A shotgun snap for Herbert. It's complete to Cook. And he's brought down, but not before he reaches the eight-yard line. A big game that time for the Chargers. This defense is definitely real. And he's going to lose a yard. Lose it. So they often bring heat and pressure, which they did on this play. Got him down for a loss. Not a big one. But any loss of yardage in this position is tough for an offense. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one-yard line. He turned that into a nice game. Gets him eight yards closer for third down. Eckler will take this into the end zone for a Charger touchdown. Able to punch it in on third down makes it easier for those guys on the sideline. They didn't have a fourth down decision to make. Yeah, could you feel the exhale? Because they were already thinking ahead as all the good coaching staffs do. Anticipating what we have to make the call. They already had it lined up. Never even got to it. Hopkins with the extra point. And it's now 17-14. Following the touchdown, Dustin Hopkins will kick it away. Now Pollard. And they will wrangle him down. On first and ten, Prescott. And the Chargers rush is going to get... 